Welcome to a cup of coffee and feels good, man. For those of you who know, it's Pepe the Frog. I did a video um, which I thought was this package. Uh, I think it's like two episodes ago. I will link it right up here. Uh, and that was something completely different that I didn't expect. But the face expression of joy and stokeness on that video, amazing. Amazing. Real reaction unboxing. Now I know what it is because uh, it says on the back of it. Mm. Great coffee from uh, Café Labenhaugesen. Ah. Okay, just have my hair all the way in front because I look more sexy when I have that hair. <laughs> How are you guys doing by the way? Join me on my live stream today on Instagram. If you're watching this on a Friday, then I have a live stream on Instagram every Friday at 1300. So join me there. 1300 UTC plus one. one. And yes, this amazing painting of Iggy Pop in the background. It's one of the paintings I did during a live stream, and you can watch that. On if you go on IGTV on Instagram, you can watch me start and uh, halfway finish the painting. But it's in the IGTV files, and it's for sale. So if you want to buy it, just contact me so I can pay my rent. Okay. Why am I sitting without a t-shirt? Well, summer is arriving and it's going to be more street skating. But also because I already knew that I ordered a motherfucking t-shirt. Da -da Damn. Look at that. Grim as fuck. I just got my Dark Throne uh, vinyl box. Uh, go to my Instagram to see that. And... Uh, or just go to Dark Drone on Instagram and see it. But it says nothing is forever. And it's Peppy the Frog and the gang hanging out, drinking beer at the graveyard. Which is an amazing t-shirt. And that's why I don't have a t-shirt on. Because I was going to put this on. Might take it off again though because it is quite hot in here. So that's why I took off all my clothes. Size small? Is it too small? Okay. Careful washing this. Let's see. Yeah, looks good. Because I like t shirts that fit me. Hey! Looks good. Uh, I haven't. S I'm not gonna sit. Blah, blah, blah. Ignore. I'm gonna enjoy this coffee while it's still hot. Okay. I was just about to say something, but that would be a spoiler. Okay, if you ordered, um, pre-ordered the Feels Good Man, that's the name of the documentary of uh, Peppy the Frog. If you don't know who Peppy the Frog is, just Google it, like P-E-P-E, P-E-P, -E -E, <laughs> the frog, and you will see a lot of weird shit. Most likely you will find a lot of um, uh, memes that are pretty cruel and bad I don't want to say the word out because I'm afraid my video will be monetized if I say the word but it's people who like to be more on the right than on to the left if that makes sense and uh, they uh, and they used him also as a meme for Donald Trump uh, in a positive way that Pepe was supporting Trump which Pepe was never about the politics it's just about a gang of dudes having a good time anyway when you pre-order the, look at how cool it looks, and look how planned this is. Pepe the Frog feels good, man. Uh, the New York Times called this a vertiginous head-slapping examination of the tangible, unpredictable consequences of making art. So, this is, really, really, I love it when the DVDs come, it's like in carton. And it's just very classic, simple design. And you got a hologram sticker. Woo! I want to make Ken the Chicken hologram stickers like this. So you've got that when you pre-ordered the, the DVD. And I couldn't resist. I also got the soundtrack on vinyl. Just look how amazing all this looks. This, I already have my thumbnail ready. Like this. Trying to see how it will look. Yeah. Huh? 
so much green and you have Iggy in the back there painting for sale people and I do commissions also drawings Fuck yeah. so Matt Fury is the guy behind Peppy the Frog uh, well, I should open this uh, while you are enjoying me and the beautiful face of me I'm gonna show you here in the background this is where all the fantographic books are almost looks like I planned this as well but I didn't I have one of the coffee books at home, but this is the origin, basically about Pepe the Frog. And I love how Fantagraphics put the, the ta like the barcode over his eyes. Really cool book, uh, simple, straight to the case drawings. And I'm gonna see. I should have uh, had this ready though. But the reason for the title of the documentary being uh, feels good, man. Uh, there's a reason behind this, and I'm gonna show it to you. There it is. Yeah, man. There's Peppy the Frog. And uh, can you see it? Oh, sorry about the light. I'm not a professional YouTuber, I'm an amateur. There, Peppy, he pulls down his, his pants and his trousers, and then his homie comes in. Oh, whoops! Later that day, like. Hey Pepe, I heard you pull your pants down all the way to go pee. And he says, feels good man. So this is where it came from. You can get this uh, from Fantagraphics. Also check out the video of this. In this link of the video where I open all the Fantagraphics. The Fantagraphic books that I've ordered. Mm. Now we're gonna go and look at this. We're gonna open the DVD, see if uh, there's some cool photos or something inside. I lost my eraser that I oh, that I use to open vinyl and stuff. Oh come on! There you go. Gonna watch this uh, most likely tonight because I can't wait. Because I've been looking really. If you go on YouTube, you can see a trailer for this. And uh, it looks really fucking good. A lot of cool people too uh, are joining in on the documentary and talking about how fucking bad things can go when people abuse your character. I wish somebody would do the same with my Ken the Chicken. Ken the Chicken you say? Yes, it's my cartoon. Which you can buy at CaféFantine.com. Link below! Buy my comics, man! The latest one is Ken the Chicken Volume 4. It's in Norwegian only uh, for now. And it's about Ken the Chicken going to a whorehouse. I'm not gonna say anything more. It's a beautiful uh, cardboard box DVD thing. Open it like this, and you can see Matt Fury's drawing table. That's where uh, Pepe the Frog comics have been made. Classic with a lot of cool shit. I love seeing how other artists work. Which comic book artist should I check out? Write in the comments below because I want to check out more. And then you have the, here's the comic that I just showed you, where he says, feels good, man. That's printed on the actual disc. Does it say anything with funny quotes on this? Because that's always fun when you do that. The only shit thing, though, I don't know if this plays on my PlayStation. So I'll find that out when I get home. And here you have all his toys. It's Matt Curry. He's a childish kind of weird guy. I love him. A little bit too innocent for my taste, though. But his comics are pretty good. There you see all the toys and stuff. That was the DVD. Classic, plain, straight to the point. And then we have the vinyl. Do, 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 do. Should have had something to open with though. We're gonna use the whole. Oh, it's open. Normally I, would, I always have um, the plastic on, but now I, I fucked up. Because I have so much records that it's starting to become a problem actually. So, because I can have plastic on the vinyl. And it survived pretty good uh, during the shipping. Only like a tiny, tiny, tiny little dent there. But I can survive. So, original motion picture soundtrack by Ari Balus Balusian and Ryan Hope. A praise for LP. <sighs> oh, and it's double. Oh no, I thought it was going to be green. Oh, that's a little bit disappointing. It's still beautiful though. Feels good, man. Simple. 
get the frog on, of course, Pepe. Let's see if there's any Warbot always have like funny stuff scripted into the vinyl. Here it's nothing. It's not supposed to be anything, but it's always cool when they add like small details. So double vinyl people. I had to wait a little bit extra to get my order because of the vinyl. Because uh, I was pre-ordered and uh, because of Corona and shit, the shipping had to be, you had to wait. Yeah, I'm gonna take a spin with these. I think I'm gonna wait though, uh, listening to this record, even though I really want to, uh, because I wanna get the experience, you know, of uh, the movie. Yeah, feels good, man. That was it. It's good to have some short videos sometimes as well, because I, it's already ten minutes over though. But uh, yeah, check out uh, feels good, man. It's on Instagram. I'm gonna let you do the the search. Maybe I will link it below. Maybe not. Who knows? But check it out. But just go to feels good, man, on uh, on Instagram, and you can get the link to get all of this cool stuff. Now I'm going to try and take a photo of this for the thumbnail because it looks really good. Thanks for watching. Check out um, uh, my Instagram live, 1300 UTC plus one on Instagram every Friday and also here on YouTube. Of course, if, you're, if this is your first video on my channel, there's a new video uh, and an episode of a cup of coffee every Friday. Just subscribe and click the bell and shit and you will get notified when it comes out. Um, if you guys want to send me anything, if you're a publisher, if you're self-published, if you're a musician, whatever, just send it to my studio. Just go to Cafe Fancina uh, on, uh, on Instagram. Uh, you can also find the address in the link below on the web shop, cafefancina.com, where all my comics and prints and t-shirts, everything is for sale. And then... Um, just send me shit to my studio and I will do an unboxing right unboxing though so I know that you want me to unbox it all right support your favorite comic book artists like I do because then we can keep creating cool shit for you to enjoy goodbye